cheap games, Xbox Live, and PSN codes, check out G2A in description and use the code ECHO at checkout. Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Echo and welcome back to another Minecraft Xbox modded map showcase. I am showcasing today the No Grief mod. This is awesome to have in your survival world when someone spawns in the game. They simply can't break any blocks at all and maybe this can be used in the future of Hunger Games maps where in certain maps the only thing you can access is chests and no ability to break blocks. Now if you guys do enjoy these videos and you would like to see more, be sure to thumbs it up, it helps me out and helps other people find my YouTube channel. As for the creator, the creator of this map is Dacon Black Rose. You can check out his channel in description along with a download to this map. Now guys, go and support Dacon Black Rose because he's only one of a handful of modded map makers on console version today. So for him to continue to make maps, go and support him. And if you're familiar with my channel, he's the creator of the Lucky Block Sky Factory series I do. So yeah, let's get into this. Let's have some fun. I'm going to show you what it's all about. So previously on Minecraft console, the only way to disable people uh, breaking blocks, placing blocks is with host commands. However, you could probably use this in a modded map in survival. I am currently the host of this world, meaning I can break and place blocks anywhere I want. I can't disable it for myself. As you guys can see, if I go to host options, there's a few host options on there, but I simply can't click on my name and set, select disable breaking blocks or, pre or placing blocks. However, I can't simply break any block here. I simply can't place a block at all in this select red area. However, if I come to the border here, I can break a block, I can pl place a block, I can break a block, and I can place a block and stuff like that. So there is a select area you can do it in and it's great for spawn. So for example, this was your spawn point. Again, I can't break or place. You could have bedrock all the way around here. You could have this as the spawn point and then the portal to go to the select location. Meaning that people can't break out and go to wherever they want. It's awesome. I really like the design. It's very simple, but it's very effective. I'm not going to spoil how he does it. Go and check out his tutorial on his channel. So as you guys can see in this select area, we have the no build, which is currently set to, and the build option. So for example, if I select this, wait for it to flash, I can then grab myself, for example, a chest, and then chest, these, 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 um, some ores, and I can simply place them down. So as you guys can see, I can place a chest. I can place an ender, uh, sorry, a crafting bench. I can set like an ender chest. A furnace, this, I can place these, I can place these everywhere, anywhere I want to. Um, and again, it's really, 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 really awesome. I think it's possibly one of the greatest additions. Again, I know how he does it, and some people may not know how he does it, but others won't. So I'm going to place down a bunch of these, and I'm going to simply select, like, no build, so I can't break or access any of these. So as you guys can see, I can open this, I can open this, I can access this, this, and this. However, if I come over to here, and I simply click this, this will flash, once it's flashed, I now don't have the ability to break any blocks in this select area. It is absolutely awesome. It's great, it really is a great addition. So I can't break this, I can't do anything at all. I'm trying to open it. I simply can't open it at all. Um, the same with, the, with the, this, I can't open it at all. So it really is very effective and I want to see what people come up to with this uh, official uh, addition. Again, it's only this select area. Maybe it can be expanded to bigger. Um, but this is something that you'd have in a spawn, so I'm not going to make a spawn area, but for example, this was all bedrock like I did say. No one can break anything at all. Um, in fact, let me quickly do a quick test here. We're going to test this. So I went to uh, build. We want the option to build. It's like it's like commands, technically. It's like a command because you guys can't see how it works. Um, in fact, let's just leave these here. So maybe I wanted the whole area like this to be all diamond. So I made like a, let's just quickly do this. I made myself like a diamond wall so people can't escape and stuff like that. Um, but obviously when people see diamond, no matter what, if you're like me and you play Minecraft, when you see diamond or you see anything like this, especially on Minecraft console, all you want to do is break it. You just want to break the ability um, and see if you can break and steal the diamonds. Everyone has to admit they secretly would like to do that. Um, but having the option of this in your world means that it's it's a big tease. People can't do it, but they would like to. So I'm going to quickly do a border like this. Just for an example of how you could use this in your world. Maybe people could use this select world and turn it into something magical. And if you do, feel free to tweet some pictures towards me. Also, if you guys have any other maps, 
If you're a map maker and you have your own map and you think that it deserves a little bit of recognition, feel free to tweet it towards me because I want to try and keep the Minecraft Xbox community alive as much as possible. So let's just switch this off for this. So you had this here. This is how you had it going. So this is how you had it. Um, this is what you wanted. So you wanted people, in fact, one last thing, you wanted people to not be able to get around the back here. You just wanted them to spawn in this location and then go to, I don't know, a build wars, a sky wars or something like that. I know you guys can jump out and stuff, but pretend you couldn't for the sake of this. So I switched this with this. You wanted to light this up. You wanted people to just simply spawn here. They drop in the world. They land here. And then I'm going to do the ability to no build. So no building at all, which means no breaking blocks, no placing blocks. As you guys can see, I simply can't break these. I can't break the portal. I can't break this at all. Nothing at all. It's simply where you spawn, and after spawning, you have to go through the portal. No matter what, because normally you want to break these. So I think overall, when I first checked this and I didn't know how he did it, I was absolutely gobsmacked. I know how he does it, and I still think it's an incredibly simple but a very effective way. Um, and I'm sure you guys can come up with some great creations with this. I want to see some map makers give this a go, make this a select area, use their build and no build functionality. Uh, but nonetheless, just have fun with it because it's all about having fun. While we don't have the option to to use these technically on Minecraft, Xbox, or PlayStation. Hopefully in the future we will. So if you guys do enjoy the mod showcases and you would like to see more, be sure to thumbs it up, support the video, support Daycom Black Rose. And as always, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Bye!